this is a common question because when most people think of drinking juice, what do you think of? You might think of like, I don't know, a little juice cup or something you have to go with your breakfast with some toast or something like that. Um, what I'm going to show you is a little bit, a little bit more than that. So, um, if you realistically, let's say you want to lose weight and you want to replace a meal with juice and you try and, I don't know, and you drink this much juice here. You say, all right, I'm going to breakfast. I've got to go to lunch on that. You're, you know, you're not going to have a lot of success there. Um, so, how much do you need? Here are some rules of thumb. Um, hey, Doc, could you actually, I had a mason jar that I think in my, the box in there that I didn't get taken out here. Um, I would say a person my weight, you know, I'm, I'm maybe 160, something like that. I drink about 32 ounces of juice. This is a 32 ounce mason jar, so probably everybody knows what a mason jar is. That's a 32 ounce mason jar. So I would have that thing filled up to the top. And that's about how much I would, you know, I drink in the morning if I'm going to have that for breakfast. So that's more than you probably think about of drinking <laughs> juice when you drink juice, right? Now, if you're like my wife, she, I don't know, she, she doesn't think she can drink very much at a time or whatever. So um, maybe you'll need to take it with you and kind of sip on it for an hour or something like that. But um, if you're going to do it, you have to get amounts that are going to put enough nutrients in your body that you'll not be hungry, that you actually get what you need, that um, you have enough energy in there to go. So that, that's what I would say for a person like me. Now if you're, if you're heavier than that, then you probably need some more, but not that much more. So if you're heavier and you want to lose weight, the goal is for you to not be as heavy as you are. right? So you don't need to consistently always drink that much more, but initially your body is going to have a little bit higher requirement of you know just your basal metabolism or whatever to get through the day so you probably need to start out with a little bit more but you know as you lose weight you you'll you probably be able to do a little bit less so the maximum I would think people really need um, is is about I think I had about 50 ounces on there so maybe one and a half of those mason jars all right um, so does that give everybody a good good idea of what we're talking about at Mount Wise here all right so more than you're probably used to, but it will work. Um, I mean, I can go. I mean, I can go. I usually have breakfast around seven. I mean, I go to noon, sometimes even till two, because a lot of times we'll work out and not eat till around two. And sometimes I'll have some finger food or some I don't know dates or something in between. But if I drink enough, it's not it's not a hunger issue with that. So, but you have to get enough. So don't be stingy on the juice and think you're you're starving yourself or something like that. It's not what we're talking about here. How to measure it, um, this thing here, like these newer Jack the Lane ones, they didn't always have this, but they, they come out for newfangled ways that have little gadgets here. So this this is a stuff to catch the liquid, and this tells you, hey, there's 32 ounces to that line, that's 24, that's 16. So if you buy one of these that has one of those, great. It's already set up for that. Um, if not, a lot of times what I use, I just use a Tupperware to catch the stuff under there and then I'll pour it into the mason jar and figure out when I have enough. And, and, and I know from doing it about how much that takes, so I just drink all of what I have, but I know about how much it takes to get what I need there. So um, that's what I would recommend doing. It. Find a simple way um, to measure it, maybe an empty peanut butter jar, maybe a mason jar, maybe something that you know how many ounces are on there, and then you juice it, you fill that thing up, that's the right amount, um, you drink it, and then you're done. All right?